Hello, welcome to another Mad Hatter review. So, uh, Turtle Tuesday, hashtag Turtle Tuesday. Gonna dive into uh, some uh, turtle updates. Also some non-turtle toy news. Um, last video, last video we spotlighted the uh, NECA incident that somebody caught on camera or what they perceived was some funny business going on at Target. Lots of controversy and talk back and this and that and uh you know people rightfully uh uh indignant about what they are perceiving happening again no judgments on this side i don't know what's happening but uh yeah a lot of passionate people i'm passionate too i get it all in all look you know it, it, we get this passionate because we obviously enjoy the the we, we're we're fans of the product we like the product we just want to have the product and on that note I'm still looking uh, uh, for the damn product, it's, but I think I'm getting close. I, I can smell it. I can smell getting close. So back to let, let's dive into the the, the 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 turtle update. That's the past. Let's move into the future. Dive into the turtle update. So Judith Hoag, again, just kind of like spotlighting. There's a video up on uh, on Neca's uh, 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 Twitter. You kind of give she gives sort of the behind the scenes of the making of her uh, ultimate figure. And what I like, what I thought was interesting is uh, the packaging is really, really cool. Uh, here it is. It's a sort of like the news, uh, April sort of on the news and the different TV screens. So um, great packaging. NECA's always, always really, really, really sharp uh, uh, with their packaging. And, um, and I think they also may have showed some more painted accessories or things like that. Still no word on... Um, when this is dropping or what's going to happen. Um, although I would think April in the month of April, uh, I would think that would uh, make sense, but maybe not. I know, you know, next Friday, well, we'll get into that. But anyway, check that out. That's the, that, that's sort of the, uh, uh, the update. That's all, uh, the only update that I think they put out is sort of like just uh, the packaging uh, uh, for, the, for the April O'Neil, the ultimate April O'Neil figure. Uh, moving forward, uh, obviously you can still get the Ace Duck and, uh, the, the Ace Duck and Mutagen Man 2-pack. You can get that until the 25th. Pizza Monsters are gone. Bye. They're, they're, they, they have gone the way of the Dodo. You have to get them in that window. Although, NECA did say that, um, these are also going to drop in Target. So, if you don't want to, you know, if you don't want to pay the shipping and you want to sort of take your chances in the, uh, in the uh, vast wasteland known as Target, you can go ahead. I was like, screw that. I just locked them in because I'm locking them in. You know what I mean? I, I don't want to hunt. I'm sick of hunting. Uh, uh, I'm really sick of hunting now. So uh, I'm just going to lock them in. Uh, I still have not gotten the Ace Duck, but uh, I'll, I'll lock that in this week. And then obviously this Friday... The, the the last drop. Um, some people are saying it's going to be the ultimate April. I think it's going to be another cartoon figure. It seems like that's the theme, is they're doing cartoon uh, figures. I think it's going to be Irma. Uh, what do I know? But uh, And then, obviously, pre... Uh, 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 not pre-releases, uh, re-releases of things that you can only get at Target before. I'm thinking Rock Soldiers, and then uh, who knows? You know, maybe April, maybe be Bob and Rocksteady, but things that you could not get uh, get before. Maybe... Maybe they go out with a bang and they say, disguise pack. And then, guess what? Around the world, you can just hear sighs of relief. And then you can also hear the no's from all the scalpers. I would love that. If they just dropped that and just fucked over every scalper and just like in one hit, I would love that. But I don't think they're going to do that. I don't see them putting out the disguise pack um, uh, that early. Uh, but may maybe they will. Hey. Miracles do happen, but yes, the collective size of us uh, fans would would be would uh, would be deafening. Um, but what else on the NECA side? Oh, the uh, uh, Genghis and Rasputin are out. Okay, on the forums, there have been there was one guy that released a, a picture. Everybody called him a goddamn liar. But then another guy, another guy, another guy, and now it is it is it is uh, 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 you can't argue it. It's out. It's out. Um, I don't think it's out on the West Coast. I want to say it's out in like Texas or something. 
Uh, but uh, they are coming out. They're already going up on eBay or Mercari. Uh, I, I forgot, but somebody bought it already for $200. Stop it. Stop doing that. Stop. You won't stop, but it's okay. Um, uh, but yeah, so, but that is out now. So I'm just going to add that to the things that I have to hunt for. Uh, you know, I'm already in there. I'm already in Target bothering people and asking them, you know, hey, do you have the turtles in disguise? I'll just, you know, I'll just make it a, a two for one. So, so those are out now to add just some added stress right there. And then what else on the turtle side? I think that is it. Uh, I'm wondering when that ultimate foot soldier is dropping. Um, he should be dropping soon, I would think. So, um, but yeah, no word on, uh, I didn't see anybody selling them or anything of that nature. Uh, replacement heads, you know, somebody uh, contacted me saying they had, uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm, so just to recap, I, I, I need a replacement head for uh, this raft. It came out, it came without a tongue. There's no tongue, just this little black thing in there. You can see where a tongue is supposed to be. Um, so I'm a little worried because about a month and a half ago, I asked for a replacement head from NECA on Instagram and they were like, okay, let me take down your information. Um, so he took down my information. And then when I asked for an update today, he was like, you should contact customer support. And I was like, okay, I'll contact customer support. But the last time I contact customer support, they're like, hit us up on Instagram. And then I contacted them again. And they were like, oh, um, you know, we don't have replacement heads for this yet. Yet go back to your retailer. But the retailer is just like a dude of Frankenstein's who's not going to take that back. So now I'm real worried because if he comes back to me and says, yeah, no replacements, then I paid $130 for a tongueless head. So I say all that to say, NECA, make this right. Send me a correct Raphael head. All right. It's got no tongue. That should not be. But um, I'll let you guys know what they say, what customer uh, service uh, says. And uh, woe unto any man who denies me uh, my replacement head. But um, I think that's it for the NECA TMNT of it all. Um, what else? I've been getting into Masters of Universe Origins a lot. More. I've, I've been sort of, I have a... So I have a giant collection that I have to kind of organize of Master of the Universe classics. And when Origins came out, I was like, I'm not going to get into another line. But here I am in the Origins line. OK, I'm starting to pick up Origins figures and and um, uh, I don't know. They're just appealing. I, I, I'm just I have a disease. OK, I, I'll just say it that way. But um, I know that they have this uh, Keldor and Cronus uh, two pack that is uh that is in Target, so I'm I'm checking. It's another Target exclusive, another Target exclusive. God damn it! So I'm 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 putting that into the rotation too because I'm checking Targets uh, uh, anyway. So I'm trying to uh, to find that one as well. Although there have been a lot of people in my area that have found them, so I'm hoping to get lucky because I think they release they're releasing more than just I think two or three uh, in stores. Funny enough, I went today to Target and. Um, somebody was asking for it. They didn't have any, <clears throat> but someone found, I guess a target employee had a box full of, uh, Modulox. If you guys are uh, Marvel Legends fans, they had a box of three and the guy got one and he said the one target employee said it was okay. But then another target employee came in and said, that is not street dated. You cannot get that thing that's in your hand. It's street dated until the 25th. And the guy's like, but the dude said it was okay. And it was a whole fight. This dude really wanted that Modulock, and I felt bad for him because it's like he had it in his hand. It's kind of fucked up. You have it in your hand. Just I think just if the if the target employee made the mistake of giving it to the customer, customer should have, I think, been able to just get it. But then another kind of like uh, boss lady came in. She's like, no, you can't. It's a whole fight, whole big fight in, in, in Target. That was that was a fun morning. And little old me is just trying to get Ninja Turtles. And I just kind of like was like, you know. That's you guys. My name's Paul, and that's between y'all. But I, I, I still, um, I overheard the whole thing, and um, and yeah. So you Marvel Legends fans, um, here's a tip: Eagle Rock is gonna have those Modulocks on the 25th. So uh, at least according to, unless they they hide them or they mysteriously lose them, they should have those on the 20th. Eagle Rock, California. So FYI, uh, take that for what it's worth, and. 
the uh oh and also i'm looking for a panthor skeletor panthor this is a walmart exclusive my buddy ej told me about and um this is flocked so he's got the flock he's obviously obviously throwback have not found him in stores but it's walmart so probably it's gonna be a shit show and there's nobody's gonna know what what the fuck i'm talking about anyway but i'm gonna put that in the old rotation as well and then finally the last thing i want to talk about are these battle toads so this premium DNA toys sort of, uh, uh, not sort of, released, I guess, the last figure, this General Slaughter figure. This is the biggest one in the line, and you can see what it looks like when compared to, to the rest. It's huge. 15-inch tall, massive end boss figure, 32 points of articulation, interchangeable hands, three head sculpts. Looks phenomenal. I love the head on the right-hand side, okay? So, um, that is the, the, the latest one that they put up, but th they also had announced that this is all available right now. You can get these Battletoads right now. You can pre-order them right now. Now, um, I want to wait to see if this goes up on Big Bad Toy Stores or on Entertainment Earth because um, I don't know this company, okay? I don't know who Premium DNA Toys is but i have heard enough from some of the talk back in the videos i've been doing about battle toads that makes me wary of ordering from directly from them because if you order directly from them you are not protected and you apparently you got to pay now so is this going to go up for pre-order on a retailer i don't know but this is going to cost if you want the all-in it's going to cost $365. So I can't uh, I can't in good consciousness buy... This is awesome, but I can't in good consciousness PO something for $365 when I don't know the company and I have a lot of people kind of like in my ear saying like, hey, look out. Um, you know, nothing against premium DNA toys, but again, just don't know. Don't do not... I, I don't know who they are. So, but if you want them... You can go to their site. You can take a chance. I'm going to wait till I see it on a retailer. Um, by the way, if you just wanted the Battletoads, they're 48 bucks each. And part of me was even thinking, I was like, should I just try to get the Battletoads themselves? But no, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait and see what happens. Um, but it would be a shame if they didn't go up on retailers because these are awesome looking figures. Um, but we'll see. Or maybe wait till people have them in hand, but maybe they're sold out by then. But uh, but yeah, uh, I, 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 I shall not part with my money uh if i if i don't feel if i don't feel safe so uh but that's it that's all i got for toy news so ninja turtle some math the uh, master universe origins some battle toads this guy's still waiting for a tongue and um that is all i have comment subscribe uh give us a like please and we will see you next time Bye bye